By the late 1990s, my mate Bushy and I were becoming absolute soft plastic addicts. But like a lot of other people at that time, we needed to import most of our soft plastics from overseas. There just wasn't a sufficient range on the Australian market to do the things that we wanted to do. It was at about that stage that John Dunphy from Shimano Australia came to us and asked us if we'd like to design a uniquely Australian range of soft plastics from the ground up. We said yes, and the squidgies were born. For over a decade, squidgies have been the number one name in soft plastics in Australia, so much so that the word has actually become a generic term for soft plastics in many circles. People say, are you using a squidgy? <laughs> we always are using a squidgy. Now look, we started off with just three tail designs and a couple of different jig heads and we've slowly added to the range as the years have gone by. We only add new things when we see a clear and distinct need for them, usually in our own fishing. This year, we're very proud to announce the arrival of two new members on the Squidgy team. That's the Squidgy Mongrel and the Squidgy Ridgeback. Now, these are integrated hook and weight swim baits, things like the slick rigs that have been around for quite a few years, but we've taken it one step beyond the slick rigs. These are a really sophisticated plastic with a, a very tight body roll and a shimmy, a great action in the water, super realistic appearance and an integrated hook and weight that fits beautifully inside them. They cast like a bullet, but you can easily take that weight out and re-rig these plastics weedless, Texan style, throw them back in the weeds, back in the snags, catch barramundi, catch bass, catch Murray cod. These are great. We reckon we're really gonna kick some goals with the mongrel and the ridgeback. The ridgeback in particular is the first curly-tailed integrated hook swim bait that we've ever produced in the squidgy range particularly happy with that one. And of course, they're in the pro range, so they come with that S-factor. Little rub of S-factor on there, and there's nothing they won't catch.